in Dominica we have something that scientists will call volcanic unrest and really volcanic unrest in this context is essentially periods of increased seismic activity particularly associated with the volcanoes in this case in southern Dominica and that's simply what's happening. The current period of elevated seismicity in Dominica started in December 2018. Every day more or less you have a couple of earthquakes but there are periods within that period of activity where the earthquakes become even more intense. You have a lot more earthquakes. The earthquakes are usually very small in magnitude so it's unlikely that people would feel them but there are occasions when they could get big enough shallow enough that people would feel them. So there have been periods in December 2018, in February 2019 and also in June when there was so many earthquakes and some of them were big enough to be felt. So you could think of it as continued elevated seismicity but within that continuation you have peaks. The activity they have in Dominic is, is a result of the fact that Dominic is essentially volcanic um, and in volcanic regions particularly areas where you have potentially active volcanoes from time to time you'd have a certain kind of activity. So one of the reasons that we know you have these potentially um, live volcanoes is because they have young rocks, you have fumaroles and you have earthquakes that become quite elevated from time to time under them. So we have essentially intensified the monitoring. We have provided a lot more regular updates to government and we have suggested to them what they should do in terms of ensuring they have their plans and protocols in place in the event of things elevating or increasing. Given past activity is likely that it will simply go back to background level and nothing would happen but there is a small possibility that it can escalate towards some kind of other kind of activity, some sort of eruptive activity of some kind. Given again past of what I've done in the past in that particular area you can have some sort of steam explosion but you could something have something more intense. At this point in time, it's too early to say exactly which direction. Listen out for official sources of information and educate yourself and ensure that you know what to do in the event of something escalating.